Families of transgender children in Texas are facing decisions amid restrictions. So either stay or, or move, right? So at the end of this school year, this school year that we're in right now, a family of four from Austin, Texas plans to uproot their lives and move over 2,000 miles away to Portland, Oregon. Uh, the family says they're moving because they're fear of their safety of the 10-year-old transgender daughter in the wake of Governor Greg Abbott's decision in February to direct the Texas Department of Family Protective Service to investigate reports of gender affairing care as child abuse. Um, Right now, there's a mom right now that is halfway packed in boxes. Um, you know, but there are a group of moms who publicly advocate for changes to rights during the Texas legislature last session, testifying at the Texas Capitol and ultimately helping to defeat dozens of bills targeting transgender people. When Abbott announced the directive in February, she thought her family would stay put and continue to fight in Texas, but the threat became too great. Of course, according to the Department of Family and Protective Service, at least nine investigations has been open on families since February, um, but it's expected to rule soon whether the state can resume their investigations. In March, a district judge blocked state agencies from investigating gender confirming care as child abuse and issuing a temporary injunction after hearing the parents of the 16-year-old transgender girl who were, her were under investigation. Um, so gender, in case you do not know what it's about. So gender... Affirmation is when transgender people make changes to their lives in accordance with their gender, gender identity. This could be um, through a change of clothing, lifestyle, mannerism, names, and pronouns. Also, it came in the form of hormone therapy or surgeries to alter one's physical characteristics. Um, so let me just stop right there. Okay, I don't see... I don't see a problem with this. Um, I really don't. I don't really see a problem with this. If they, uh, they're they expressing of who they are, this is who they are, this is who, this is the person that they're going with, they feel confident, and they feel like they feel like they're being themselves. They don't have to act like somebody else. This is what they want. That's their personality. That's their persona. And so just let them be. If you have a problem, then, then leave. You know, plain and simple. It's like being, it's like then people are being part of the LGBTQIA plus community. You know, it does not matter who you are. Going back to my student, it does not matter who you are. I will support you. I will help you. If you need somebody to talk to, I am here. Okay? Okay? I am here. Don't fret. I got you. Talk to me. I can tell you what's going on. So hopefully the families in Texas don't have to I uh, don't have to move, hopefully. Hopefully, they don't have to move. Uh, that'll be, it'll be really devastating if they do have to move. Um, so, 